What is going on, guys? Welcome to another episode here with Simpson Racing. My name is Simpson. We are back here with American Truck Simulator. And man, we had a long stream the past few times here on this channel. And we're going to continue to trend with another long stream, hopefully, we'll see, of American Truck Simulator. And today we are trying to focus on getting long hauls and making a lot of money because. I have about 400 and change thousand dollars in loans in this game. You know, I bought a big garage. I've hired two drivers and we're trying to expand and get larger and larger. So the only way for us to do this is to get onto long drives, large trucks and getting that money. So if we're looking at the deals right now, the best deal that we got right now is the all terrain crane, which is 77,000 pounds. And it will pay us $35,000 to go from Santa Fe to Kingman, Arizona. And to that, I say, yes, please give me some more. So let's go ahead and get that and go pick it up. We've got our beautiful truck here. Uh, no more uh, red. It is now black. We did change out the, uh, the front bumper right there. Oh, looks so nice. All right, anyway. Let's go ahead and get inside, turn this baby up. And let's ride. And we also upgraded to the um, 18 speed manual transmission. And I'm using the splitter. Sometimes I don't even reach the full 18 speeds Unless I switch There we go, I'm not stopping for that I mean, 77,000 pounds shouldn't even be that much anyway. Alright, now last time we were doing the stream, it was on uh, Truckers MP, today we are doing it on a good old single player, because I kind of missed the traffic, I want the trucks, I want cars everywhere, I kind of missed that, so. That's why sometimes I like to play on the single player. Let's go ahead and look at that delivery. Yes, ma'am. Take job. And I think it's right there in front of us. Oh, 
gonna fix our truck here. Got an attached trailer. And we are ready to go. Can't really see out of these trees. Nice and easy, here we go. Nice wide turn. Very nice. Very, very nice. If you actually notice in the game, my steering wheel in game is the same as the one that I have in real life, which I think is hilarious. And break, break, break. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it, it looks practically the same. It's just that the one that's in game, it's kind of going up towards the center. Mine is going up towards the outside of the rim. So, that's the only difference. Other than that, they're practically the same. and easy. Now we're in 16th gear, got two more gears to go. So you get in front of me and then you keep breaking for no reason. Well, what kind of what kind of thinking is that? What kind of logic is that? Unbelievable. Alright, let's go ahead and switch gears. Now we're in 17th gear. I think the engine that I have is a 500 horsepower engine. And then there's another one that's 510 horsepower engine so we'll see if we can upgrade to that but man are we flying 
before I started doing Turtles MP a couple of streams ago, I was in California and I really wanted to finish up the entire state of California, meaning that we I really wanted to explore every city in California and finish it completely. And we are so close. I think we maybe have like a couple left that we haven't done yet. So maybe after we do this we can go back to California and then we can continue doing work there um, and just finish it off from there so that we can be done with California and move on to Oregon or New Mexico Arizona whatever whatever that needs to be done because I want to explore the entire map like very soon unlock everything so we'll We'll see what we can do. Because I know I explored more than half. I, I know I have like maybe... Uh, I would say maybe like three or four cities left in California that we haven't had a chance to explore just yet. Now we're in 18th gear. So... I want to do that um, once we are done with this job because we're going to Kingman, Arizona and then from Kingman we can take a job to California and then we can just keep doing jobs there. Um, I would rather get a job into Cali than drive free roam to Cali. We just can get more experience and we can level up a lot faster. are all in. Don't mind me, sir. I got a delivery to make. And it's a rush delivery, too, because they would expect it to be delivered soon. And right now, it's Tuesday, 6.42 p.m. in the game, and they expect it to be delivered Wednesday at 1.34 a.m., Mountain time. So we have about like a solid five hours, six hours to go. Switch back to the right lane here. We're doing good on gas right now. We're a little bit over half a tank left. Which is pretty good. Come on, give me 75. Right now we're at 73 miles per hour. Okay, it's not gonna go any uh, 74, there we go. One more. There we go. There we go. Now, because I don't have the actual the SRX shifter, um, and I'm not using it, so I have the buttons on my wheel that I pre-configured, so they act as the SRX shifter, where you know you press one button, it shifts up. Press one button, it shifts down. Um, and then I have the clutch and the pedals and the shifter here that I can just shift with. So it works. Which is the, it's like the free alternative to the SRX um, shifter knob. Which they make really nice ones too, by the way. miles per hour. Two more to go. Give me 90, babe. Come on now. No? Nope. No 90. But we are hauling, though. We are flying. 
I mean, right now we're expected to be there at 1.20 a.m. on Wednesday morning, which is good. Which is good. Actually, the sun is hitting me right in my face in the game. So it's kind of a bit obstructing my view, but you guys should be able to see fine because it's a bit darker on the stream. Which is completely fine. Approaching Gallup, yep. We have approached and passing through Gallup. Uh, this truck is just a beauty, isn't she? She's a beauty. Alright, now they're expecting us to be there at 116. Hey, Martin gave me $5,255. Thank you, Martin. That's my uh, driver in the game. Alright, they're making money. That's good. Now we have a $45,000 bank account, which is the most I've had in a while, aside from having a loan. Now, that's money that I made myself, which is pretty awesome. Go and switch gears here and uh, switch lanes, get out of the way, let them sort it out. Oh no, the accident. Back to top speed. on 16th right now. Let's get more speed. Because we lost it when we brake extremely hard, so we can slow down for that. Now they're supposed to be 1220. Oh gosh darn it. We gotta pull into the way station. Hundred and eighteen thousand pounds. That's crazy. I don't know if that's a bug in the game or something but this is not the first time this has happened where let's say a truck in front of me was pulling out of the way station and I'm right behind it and we're both trying to merge back onto the highway they would do the indicator 
to, to merge onto the highway. They don't merge onto the highway. They just stand there blocking off the entrance to the highway. So the first time this happened, I was standing behind the truck for a solid minute before I realized that they're not going to go anywhere. So then I had to move around them to get onto the highway. I don't know if that's a glitch or something, but... crazy So now we're back to that 12.34 time, which we need to make up again. It's 8.16 in game. We have about four hours to go. Just paid off our loan, which is nine thousand dollars. Fantastic. Gosh darn it, another crash? You've gotta be kidding me. Turn on our lights on. Right now we're about a half a tank of fuel. So the second half should be able to get us to Arizona. Still trying to make it that time because now 
We were doing so well. We got up as early as 12.18 or 12.15 expected arrival time. Now it's 12.29 because of the two times that we had to stop for the accident. I had to pull into the way station. And so that slowed me down. So all of that added to added time. Alright, setting the cruise control. There we go. I mean, now we're doing good time. Now it's 1227 expected arrival time. Doing a lot better now. 1226. Trying to beat the GPS arrival time. Let's see if we can do it. I'm going to get into that middle lane right there. We are sub 140 miles to go, which is pretty good. And I gotta say, racing with this wheel is not bad at all. I mean, I did play Project Cars 2 multiple times with this wheel. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. it up at the 17th gear please don't slow down again there we go coming through Now we're back to 12.14. Trying to get there as early as I can so we can get that money. Gotta get that money. Seventy eight miles to go. I'm trying to push it. I'm just trying to push it as hard as I can. Sixty-five miles to go. We're almost there now. This is it. Twelve oh nine expected arrival time. Turn the 
turn on our high beams. Get there at midnight exactly. We're a half hour away, twelve oh two estimated time of arrival. do it are we are we gonna do it before midnight hmm I think we are God, not know it's gonna be this this close. Well, we'll see. Come on. Let's go. Turn green already. Jeez. You know what? That's not even fair. Cause I made it there. I was supposed to get there at exactly midnight but with the stoppage in the traffic light now it's at 1209 it's fantastic All right, excellent. Let's go ahead and take a look at our baby right there. Look at that. Ah, so nice. Take one more.
All right, I'm good. I know it's perfect. Go ahead and unload that baby. Excellent. Wow, 1,463 experience. That is fantastic. We're almost at level 14. Look at that. I mean, $35,329. That's fantastic. What is going on in my phone? My phone is going berserk. Okay, let's go ahead and continue that. Very nice. Um, Yeah, let me just pause here for one second. I think, I think my camera is taking up lots of space here all right there we go i think this should be better this should be okay all right so right now we have about seventy one thousand nine hundred and eighty four dollars let's look at our bank here and uh we have three hundred and forty one thousand dollars we can actually pay off one of those loans and take off a solid eighteen hundred dollars off but what we should do because i really want to do that Let's look at the maps here real quick. World map. And uh, let's go down the street and make some adjustments to our vehicle. Because again, we have $71,000. Even if we were to spend... Even if we were to spend, you know, at least, say... 40 grand. We're still left with a lot of money. All right, General, what's going on, man? Mari, is it Mari? How are you, bud? Thank you for stopping by in the stream. Appreciate that. Hope you enjoy it. All right, so as we were saying before, we want to get this baby right here. That is what I'm talking about. Look at this monstrosity. Ugh. And we have the money. We have $71,000 that we can spend on it. I'm just going to go ahead and just make this just a little bit smaller there we go so that way it doesn't take in the entire entire thing so there we go look at that that is beautiful all right so we're gonna go ahead and keep that and uh which in turn would give us was it this one this is six by four this is six by two so six by four. So it has that added thing right here in the middle. So if I do this, it's not there. If I do that, it's there. So we're gonna keep that. Uh, engine, we have a 500 horsepower. We can go ahead and make it into a 510 horsepower. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Transmission, we have the 18 speed one, which is great. Love it. That's fantastic. Interior wise, I don't really need it. Just it's wooden trim. Don't really need that. Um, anything here that we would want to get? Well, that's a really cool color. But no, we're we're good with what we got. We have the black for now. We're gonna stick with that for now. So we're gonna keep it. No worries here. We haven't unlocked a lot of stuff 
there's, there's still a lot of stuff that we haven't unlocked yet that I haven't unlocked. So we're actually going to take these off. I don't want them. I just want to keep it clean. Uh, interior wise, again, not much that we can do. We have that already. So go ahead and confirm order. Fantastic service. $230. Go ahead and repair that. And let's get out of here and go and get some money. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at our beautiful little baby right there. Oh, so nice. Very, very nice. Love it. Love it. Okay. Let's get on out of here. Uh, actually, let's look at the map real quick. Um, so freight market here. What do we got? $41,000. Holy schmoly. Okay. So, um, we can actually start from this one. We can take Kingman back to New Mexico. It's $41,000. I mean, that's a lot of money. A lot of money. You gotta, you gotta really, really gotta appreciate that. That they're putting in all that money right here for us to take. Now, I did say that I want to go back to California. However, you know, it's $41,000. I mean, that's a lot of money. What do we, anything going to Cali here? Nothing, oh, this one's going to Cali. It's eight grand, eight grand. Nothing really crazy. Um... Now we can go ahead and take this baby right here. 118,000 pounds. Look at that. $41,000. We're taking it. We are most definitely going to take that. All right. Well, actually, hold on. In that case, I need to sleep. All right, let's go ahead and... There we go. Let's see what we got. Oh, yeah. I'm going to take job. It's right there. Holy smokes! That looks fantastic, you guys. Look at that. Oh, man. Alright, let's get out of here.
nice wide turn here. There we go. Nice and easy turn here. You can do it. You can do it. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thank you, sir. Just so beautiful. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now we are a little bit below half on the gas. So we're probably gonna have to stop somewhere soon not now but like soon so we'll see what happens come on keep pushing Gotta make sure that we keep it nice and steady. Yeah, we're running low on fuel. losing power on me power through power through power through come on mm. we gonna get there don't you worry about that Oh yeah, sure, the Hummer gets right in front of me, that's fantastic. Not like I can do anything about it at this point. There we go. 16th gear, baby. Are doing great the only thing is we have to stop sometime coming up maybe not now but like sometime coming up for the gas so that way we can go to refuel 
But I'm really happy with our progress. I mean, we're starting to make money now. We're investing in our trucks. We're making money. We're growing our company little by little. Even though it's still the same size, I only have two other drivers besides myself um, in the company. But they are making money, so I can't really complain about that. I was so close to firing them, but they, they pulled through and, you know, started making some, uh, some dinero. There we go, 67 miles per hour. That's what I'm talking about. It's about time that we get some uh, some speed. Actually, that would be fascinating if I can at least get to 200 miles left in this trip with one tank. Because, remember, I didn't refuel last trip. Last trip, you know, I started with a full tank and... I ended up with a little bit less than a half a tank. So if I can make it back with, if, if, I, if I end up with 200 miles left in this trip and I have to refuel, then that'll be fantastic. Man, I really need this game, but first I need a gaming PC and a steering wheel, G27. Hopefully I can get it before summer, although that's a long time. Hey man, listen, I got into this whole racing thing maybe at the end of last year. That's when I started really looking into it. Um, it's a lot of fun. You can even start with a laptop. If you can get like a nice gaming laptop, you can definitely use it. Just attach it to a monitor and you're good. If that's something that will be a little bit easy for you to do. Um, I would say if you have the money for a G27, I would get the 920, the G920 or the G29, whichever variant you want, either the PlayStation 4 and the PC or the Xbox One and the PC. So, um, if that's the route that you want to go, go for it. Also, Thrustmaster, they make really good wheels. If you want to look at the Thrustmaster T300RS, which is the PlayStation 4 variant, it's got a really nice system in it. Uh, it's also they're all belt uh, belt driven system so if you want to try that one that'd be great I think the Thrustmaster is better than Logitech uh, because that's all they do is is steering wheels and wheel bases and you can also add onto it more in the future so you can add you know clutch I think the TR 300 the T300 RS does not come with a clutch or or a shifter but those can be added on later so you can actually swap out you can add the new clutch and pedals you can get the shifter you can get the handbrake you can you can change the wheels that you're putting on the wheelbase so there's more to customize in thrustmaster um my buddy uh justin he has a tr 300 rs and he loves it so you know it's it's really about what you want but if you're starting to get into the G27 and everything, that's cool. But I would say get the G29. If you can get the G27 for a good price, go for it. But don't get ripped, don't get ripped off in that process. Is what I would definitely advise. So. But yeah, man. It, it's, I'm telling you, like, you know, doing this the steering wheel and everything it just it's all about immersion really that's all what we're trying to do is to feel immersed into this whole driving simulator truck simulator racing simulator and that's why like you know you would see people out there you know that have the large monitors which i had i had a 35 inch hp omen x monitor um but for some reason you know i returned it because i had issues with my card and everything so 
like with my graphics card at the time. It turns out it was an OBS issue, not a not my card issue, which is fine. But I went back to the 27-inch Omen um, monitor that I, I love, by the way. So you can build your own like racing simulator down the line. And that's something that I'm trying to work on. Is down the line, I want to build my own cockpit, get my racing seat in there, uh, move move this entire unit onto the racing simulator. And in that way, you would be really like fully immersed. Like I want to have there's a uh, there's a, a new monitor that just came out from LG, I believe, or Samsung. Samsung made a 49 inch ultra wide free sync display that you hook up to your computer and you can see pretty much the entire. It's like having three large monitors right in front of you. So that's something that I would love to do but everything you know costs a lot of money but that's what it is man it's, it's super expensive to get such a setup but totally worth it if you're doing it for immersion totally totally worth it if that's something that you're really into so I'm gonna switch gears here that's good we can turn off our our headlights our running lights are fine running out of fuel interesting if you guys see i'm a little dashboard there see a little gas sign showing up which is interesting because we do have to stop by and get some gasoline or diesel We gotta do it, we gotta do it soon. Hold on. Let me look at the map here. Oh, there's actually a gas station coming up. Fantastic. Okay, excellent. Fan Tabuloso. So we have 425 miles le uh, left to go. And I have to go and uh, refuel. All right. Let's go ahead and refuel. And you'll see my dial for the gas or diesel going up. And there we go. Excellent. Oh, what just happened? Come on, baby girl. Now we have a full tank of gas. We are doing great on time. Hey man, thanks for the subscription, buddy. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome to the channel. Well, this is why I have. Um, I'll show you after the, like, you know, a little bit after the stream, but um, I have two tablets, and these two tablets. See, look, I can switch the screen on my tablet, and I can have another box with buttons on it um this is actually by sim dash so if you don't want to buy the actual box you can just buy a tablet and then you know i can switch between 
both screens on it now the reason why i have that right now is because i don't have an actual cockpit that i can mount these boxes to but if i had an actual cockpit the boxes can be mounted on my fanatic so my fanatic i have screws on it that i can remove and these screws i can uh, you know mount uh, a metal a brush metal plaque on it or board and that board will have mounting holes for the uh button boxes and that would go on either side it'll be one here and then one there if you look in the camera you will see that to my left here you see where my finger is pointing that's my second tablet so i have two tablets one here and one there and they both have buttons on them that i can press on and you know and use and whatnot and that's what i've been doing you know but definitely obviously for a total immersion purchasing a button box that is the next step so first step is to getting the cockpit getting that set up you know getting my monitors on it so i don't know if i'm gonna buy like an actual tv like three tvs maybe like a 40 inch tv mount them all on the cockpit and then mount that to uh and then mount my gear to the cockpit and then go from there and then when that's done i'll get my my button boxes put them on both ends and just you know map them for the game and stuff like that and then they have like different um paper that you can put over the bot over the buttons and each each game would have their own paper so each button would have a different function you know like refuel trailer headlights uh wipers etc so yeah man it's a it's a long process but it's a costly process my goodness it's expensive It is super expensive to get this stuff but the button boxes are not that bad i mean you know there are a few websites that you can go online um and they specialize in just that and then you can actually get the two button boxes they make them in carbon fiber aluminum like brushed aluminum obviously the carbon fiber is more expensive um but you can get the brushed aluminum ones and then they also make an ignition key so instead of having that button where it says you know that red circle button where it says you know engine start and stop you can actually have an actual key okay good i can actually bypass the wait station excellent um you can actually have a key that you can turn the truck from you can turn it on instead of having a button that you just push so that's pretty cool uh and also they have another box where it's the walkie talkie box so i don't know if you can see it oh i think i probably took it off from here but i had a i had a walkie talkie button uh, i mean box up top uh that i that i you know you can talk into in the game but you again you can take that they make it in real life so you can buy it put it next to you and when you use it and you talk into it it's like you're talking in game so that's pretty cool so again it's all about immersion that's what it's all about and we're passing gallop so we're doing pretty good on time not too shabby again it's forty one thousand dollars so if we get that money we're back to forty nine thousand because right now I have, I have eight thousand dollars so plus forty one thousand say fifty grand we're back so in total i spent what twenty grand in one day to upgrade my truck and i still have money for my uh for my installments and i can pay off you know a little bit of uh the loan that i have and lower my my daily payments because you pay nine grand i pay nine grand every single day for the loan that i have it's crazy so we will see. Let's slow down here. Oh, we're good. I'm really pulling. 
and we're still below the speed limit it's 75 miles per hour speed limit we're doing 71 miles per hour now the only thing that i need to change and i keep saying on every single stream is that i want to change my sim dash um, numbers because the numbers are in kilometers per hour i want to get the miles per hour uh, these are mainly made for the euro truck simulator so obviously everywhere in the world they use kilometers per hour we're the, probably like one of three countries in the world that uses miles per hour so that's why it's like that but we can also change it and make it into miles per hour and everybody is happy let's go ahead and shift into the 17th gear there we go and obviously again the one thing that will be missing would be the srx shifter knob which would be installed right oh sorry be installed right on top of this right here um that shifter knob is going to have the button switch where if you sh you know push it up go into higher gear or lower gear depending on how you have it mapped i don't have it so i'm using the buttons on my hub on my wheel to shift between high and low gears which is my free edition cost you no money but we are doing fantabulous that's good that is a great we have 275 miles to go we're doing great we are doing great we're actually shaving up a lot of time from when we're supposed to arrive so right now in game the time is 602 estimated time of arrival is 10:35, and i'm trying to decrease that time as much as i can so hopefully we can get there a little bit earlier see from there now i love truck simulator games so i have both your truck simulator 2 i have the pro mod that comes out for it I, I have the entire game and then i have this one the only one that i'm missing is the oregon um the, the, the oregon uh dlc which i don't have just yet I need to purchase that but other than that i have everything um this game is entirely vanilla. There are no mods on it whatsoever. No graphical mods or anything of any sort. I might install a graphic mod on it only because the game seems to be a bit darker on the stream than it is in game. I noticed that when I started playing it. So maybe I'll have to look up, you know, a good graphics mod that will not ruin my game but also make it better for you guys to look at in stream because i'm looking at obs right now and i'm looking at my youtube and the game is a lot darker on the stream than it is in game so if you guys can maybe see the what i'm looking at we would uh, definitely appreciate it more that's for sure game is beautiful like don't get me wrong the game is fantastic and i cannot wait until i have a dedicated computer just for driving simulator that's that's my ultimate goal is to have this computer for my gaming computer and then just have another one just me just for racing you just get in there and just start racing in it that's what i want to do So we will see. But then the next computer, you know, I'll build. I'll, I'll have my PlayStation 4 in addition to it because I already have that. But this wheel is not compatible with PlayStation 4. So my Gran Turismo and what have you are not compatible with it. But it's the only game that I have that would really use that wheel. So I'm not really, you know, going to lose it if, if, you know, that happens. So... We shall see, but right now we are getting, we are flying. Holy smokes. Uh, 
how long do you have this YouTube channel? It seems pretty cool. We're supposed to have a nice YouTuber here. Oh, appreciate it, man. No, this is actually my... This is my second of three YouTube channels. Um, I just started this channel, like, not so long ago. And um, I have two other channels. I have Simpson Roleplay, which will have all my roleplay videos um, on it. And then I have the Simpson Show channel, which is my original channel that I started about two years ago. That one has over maybe 200 videos on it. But this one, I just started literally like, like maybe a month ago, not even. So I'm just taking that one very slow. This is my just driving channel. I'm just gonna do everything on it that has four wheels or more. Gonna be used for this channel. So I am and I appreciate it. Thank you very much, man. You are awesome. Appreciate that. But we are flying now. Right now it's it's made its own arrival. 10 13 p.m. in game time. It is 7.28 in-game time on Wednesday. And my guy is about to fall asleep. He's halfway through on that bed. So whenever you see that bed filling up halfway through in the blue, that means that he's getting tired. So hopefully he doesn't start falling asleep until we get to where we need to be. So, and then after that, we can do whatever we want. Let's go ahead and shift down a little bit. There we go. Oh man, I love this wheel so much. Uh, that wooden trim on it, it's fantastic. And it's so funny because I just changed that wheel in game. So the one that's in the in my truck right now, if you look closely, you'll notice that it's the same exact one than, than the one I have in real life. So I thought that was seriously cool because I didn't, I didn't even know that it came out. All right, we are $10,000 now in the bank. One of my other drivers was able to get more money, so that's pretty cool. All right, we have 133 miles to go. We're almost there. And we are hauling. Oh, man, we are flying in this thing. Oh, somebody's uh, stuck on the side of the road here. What's going on with that? Oh, got the hood open and everything. All right, well... Hope you have triple A. But again, I mean, you know, the game looks pretty good. It's just that I would want to find a nice mod for the graphics so that way you guys can see better on a stream, that's for sure. That's, man, I can just sit here and just play this game all day. <laughs> Appreciate it, man. Well, I think if you go on, um, if you just type in The Simpsons Show, in YouTube, you'll be able to find my main channel. So, and and that and that one has my other channels linked to it. But I do appreciate it. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. You are super nice, and I appreciate that. I mean, listen. The best thing about me doing YouTube is that I met a lot of awesome people that actually, you know, I talk to outside of, you know, the stream. So. I met a lot of awesome people that have subscribed to my other channels that I, I talk to on Discord and, you know, whatever, but it's all about, you know, if you enjoy the video, that's all that really matters to me. Um, you know, I don't really ask for anything, so if you guys enjoy the videos, just give it a like. It's all I want. You know, you don't have to do anything else, really, but I appreciate the kind words, man. Thank you very much for that. You are awesome. Thank you very, very much. Man, we are flying in this baby right here.
was a nice maneuver right there. That was pretty good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ugh. Trying to get past that car to my left here. Come on, you bastard. I mean, if I was throwing any mods on it, it, it wouldn't really be anything crazy. Like, I want to have a better sounding mod for the engine. I want to have a nice engine sound, like a nice rattling sound. Like, you know, just shakes your headphones off. Um, and then the other mod that I want is just for the graphics, just so that way you guys are not looking at a dark stream. Because I'm looking at your stream right now, and it's pretty darn dark, you know, so... Because in my game, it looks fantastic, but in your stream, it's dark. I think that's a popo. The popo in front of me. Come on, don't slow down, don't slow down, don't slow down. We are almost there, 25 miles out, and we are going to be getting there a lot earlier than anticipated. There we go. Just paid off the loan of $9,000 and stop, 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 stop. Oh my goodness. left and right real quick but see this is what I'm saying the game is extremely dark right now even though on my end it's so bright real quick here and slow down Fine, go ahead, cut me off. It's not like I'm hauling 118,000 pounds worth of stuff.
Come on, you can do it. Here we go. left real quick nobody here okay yeah man I'm enjoying this one right now but it's first I'm seeing one of your videos but after this I can watch much more of your previous videos I know I like them because it's pretty awesome thank you man I appreciate it buddy Thanks a lot for your support, man. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoy them. You know? You might not like them. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. All right. Let's go ahead here and stop. Good. All right. Where are we going to deposit this baby right here? All right. We can go ahead and deposit that there. Oh, that's not bad. I don't think I'm going to make it. Didn't make it. Name it. Come on, don't stall on me now. So let's just see if we can go ahead and Nothing really? Come on. I tried I tried and I failed so it is what it is forty one thousand one hundred and fifty one dollars and we are level 14 holy moly we are doing great you guys we are doing fantastic look at that okay so let's go ahead and hear so we have just-in-time deliveries which is great we have all of them uh, let's see what we have here I'm just trying to 
see something here real quick. Um, okay. So, we can get the fuel economy, all right, which adds, so level rank three, up to 20% of fuel saved when driving with trailer or 20% fuel saved when driving free, which is fine. How about long distance? Deliveries up to 1,000 miles, 15% higher reward for delivery distance longer than 650 miles. Okay, well, you know what? We can go ahead and add the high value. No, not high value. I'm sorry, long distance. So rank three. Wait, we're, we're rank two right now, right? We're rank one, really? So there we go, rank three. No, 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 no. You know what? Let's add this one. Fuel economy. Let's get that done. Bam. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and see where we are right now. So uh, job market, freight market, there we go. We're right here. Really, that's that's all you got? Come on, man. We're doing just great. We're making a lot of money. We're making great money, actually. All right, let's go to external contracts here. Come on, there we go. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. 77,000. This is $36,000. And this one is the same thing. Okay, let's go ahead and begin delivery. And, well, actually, before we do that, before we do that, we need to sleep because the guy has been awake for a while. So, let's go ahead. That's just great. That's just. That is just fantastic. It's exactly what I wanted to do to my truck. That is exactly what I wanted to do. drift action find a place to sleep look at the map here real quick where are we oh there we are all right let's go over here then back into first gear let's go ahead and get some sleep
Let's go. Alrighty then. Head the interbine. There we go. Getting some rest. Wake it up the next day. Beautiful. Fantabulous. Take the brakes off. Ah, so sexy. My goodness. What did I do to deserve this piece of beauty? Look at that. Oh, man. All right, let's get out of here. And while we're at it, we're going to go ahead and fill up some... Uh, Gasoline or diesel. Okay, so before we go anywhere, let's put our hazards on here real quick. All right, let's look at the map here. All right, where are we going to go now? So let's go ahead and look at the freight market real quick. And holy smokes. Wow. No, 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 no. Where are we right now? We are right here. Okay, let's let's not get ahead of ourselves here. Okay, we're right over here. So 29,000, obviously that's not as much as we found last night. So let's go ahead and look at the external contracts here. Hopefully we can find something good. So 36,000, I think that's that's the same deal that was there last night. So we're gonna go ahead and get that deal um, and begin delivery. All right, let's go ahead and get that done.
There she is. All right. Do I have a Jake break? I'm not sure, to be honest with you, what that means. Star City. Alright, let's get out of here. That's a really, really Huge delivery. Oh, my goodness. Come on, baby girl. You can do it. That's crazy. Look at that. Oh, my Lord. You know how hard it is to drive that truck from the third person camera? It's crazy. It's really hard, actually. Extremely, extremely hard. But it's a lot of fun though. We're gonna be making a right turn coming up, so I guess I'm gonna be stuck behind that charger right there. I just wanna say thank you guys so much really for uh, checking out my stream, I really appreciate that. It means a lot to me. on Popo. <clears throat> we are doing 4.1 miles to the gallon, which sounds about right. Given the amount of 
hauling that we got to do right here. That's an oversized haul right there. And my goodness, does this thing look humongous. Wait, that's an actual truck this whole time. Man, oh man. Look at that. Oh, that is just pure beauty. It's gonna put it in 16th gear right here, and we are doing great. We have a lot of gas, or I keep saying gas. It's not gas, people. It is diesel. It'll just put gas in there, and they put diesel. So I gotta stop saying that. But we are doing great on time. We are doing great with with the diesel. We are just having a blast. And I gotta tell you, I love this, because now I can sleep in my truck with no problems. Look at that. I got my cabin and everything. I can install my PlayStation, get some Madden going. Ugh. Just have a ball. Alright, let's go back in there, because I've had experiences where I'm driving in third person and i end up th trashing my truck so don't want to do that with a with a load that large almighty jaw how are you man what's going on buddy what is up what's new with you everybody almighty jaw almighty jaw has been one of the um, early awesome people that have been following me on my other channel the Simpsons show for a long time so huge shout out to you buddy thank you for always supporting the channel I appreciate you I appreciate you man here we go what are you doing being on your phone man get off your phone and uh, do your job I'm good buddy I'm good just a Sunday you know this is the first weekend where I streamed every day in a row so let's see how long that trend will continue for but other than that it's been a fantastic weekend can't complain really let's go ahead and shift up to 17th gear <laughs> thanks man thank you sir Thank you, sir. Let's see how, how far we got here. We have about 566 miles to go, and we are cutting away at the time like it's nothing. Like it's nothing. All right. Now let's see what else here. But yeah, so I mean, right now the game looks good because it's in during the day, so for you guys it looks fantastic. But I wanna make sure that, you know, I can get that nice mod and we can go from there. But man, come on, should I shift down? I think I should shift down. There we go. Shifting down. I got you, I got you. Hey, listen, we all did that, right? You know, watching stuff on our phones. That's how we do it, man. Gotta kill some time. Gotta kill some time. But yes, so, oh, so, I have old games that I'm actually thinking of playing um, on this channel. And so, hopefully, I don't know if I'm gonna record it and then upload it or just do a live stream. But we'll see. We'll see, given... Uh, We'll see what happens. We shall see. Man, it's a beautiful day out here in this game right now. It's Thursday in the game. And we are making money. Alright, let's go ahead and shift up. through 
It's like every time I shift up into 17th gear, nothing happens. It's like, you know, you have to like shift down to kick it back up again, but it's okay. We are doing it great. I think ever since we um, changed up the transmission, well, no, it was the engine, actually. I'm sorry, it was the engine. So the engine, we kicked it up a notch from 500 horsepower to 510 horsepower. Um, the RPM, I think it was, instead of 1,200 RPM, it went down to 1,000 RPM, which is even better on, gas, on the diesel. We increased our uh, oil saving perk. So right now we're rank, third rank or third level. So hopefully we can continue saving uh, on diesel and in that way it will allow us to go more trips without having to fill up as much as we should. I just filled up as much just in case if we're gonna do another job after, we don't have to fill up right away. We can fill up like maybe halfway through or you know, that way it doesn't, it, it wouldn't affect our time of arrival, so. But we're doing pretty good on time right now. We're 490 miles to go. We're, we're, fl we're zooming. We are zooming past this, which is great. Love it. I want to get the latest DLC, which is Oregon DLC. I want to get that one, but at the same time, I want to I want to finish off California because I haven't finished that one off yet. So California, I said earlier in the stream that California, I have about maybe two or three cities that I really want to finish off, and then I'll be done with California because I think that you unlock an achievement every time you unlock a city in a state so if we were to finish all of california i'll be done with it and then we can move on to i want to do new mexico we are in new mexico now but we're going back to arizona so i want to finish off new mexico i want to finish off arizona and then i'll get oregon and then i'll finish off oregon as well but so we got a lot on our plate to finish off and i cannot wait to get that done so that will be fantabulous. I gotta say, Midwest and the West, they have amazing highway systems. My goodness, because comparing it, you know, I'm from Jersey, so our highway system is not that great. You know, obviously, we're, it's in a tri-state area. And you have, a, you have New York right there, you got Pennsylvania right there, and, you know, people just everywhere. So, our highway system is like this, you know, all over the place. But I feel like, I feel like in the West and the Midwest, they have amazing, amazing highway systems. You know, obviously because they have larger states, they don't have as many people that live there as the metropolitan areas that I live in. So... You know, I, you know, I feel like they, they are better equipped. They have just better looking roads. Not a lot of potholes, I'll tell you that. That's a fact, my friend. The amount of potholes that we have in the tri-state area, <whistles> crazy, 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 crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. And they're not like small potholes, like, oh, little cute potholes here and there. No, they're like large potholes that will tackle your car and throw you off the road completely. So, you know, you gotta, you gotta be careful when you're driving in Jersey. And in New York City, I mean, it's, it's disgusting, you know? It's fun if you go with a train where you take the subway into the city, that's fine. But if you're going to be driving in Manhattan, Chinatown, going down to Brooklyn, Queens, there are some areas that are very nice. They have great roads. But the rest of it, my, and, and the traffic, 
Crazy, 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 crazy. But look at this. I mean, if you know, I, I would love to move out west. I would love to get myself a pickup truck, move out west, and call it a day. Be done with it. That's it. Done. You know, gas is cheap in the west. Weather is nice. No snow. Although I don't mind working, you know, during the snow time. It's not bad. But geez, man, like the amount of potholes, I can, I can do away with that. That's for sure. I can do away with that. All right, so we are at 400 miles to go. It is 2.38 p.m. Thursday afternoon in the game time, and we are supposed to reach our destination at 9.15 p.m. game time. So we are doing just fine. We've about seven more hours to go in game. Not in real life, of course. So we should be doing okay. Can we can we at least like shift up into like 17th gear and actually like do something with it? Because I feel like every time I shift up to 17th gear, nothing happens. It always like you know kind of like slows down a little bit. So. Let's go ahead and try to shift up at the 17th gear. No, it's not gonna happen right now. I gotta wait a little bit. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I wanna make the steering a little bit heavier so that way it doesn't wobble as much. on now darn it I shift down again every time this happens every single time I shift up into 17th gear nothing so it is all good and I think this is gallop again is this gallop I think so I have passed by gallop at least four times no, three times. In the stream. Four. Because one, two, three, four times. This is the fourth one. We are doing great. 320 miles to go. And we have less than six hours left to deliver this monstrosity. I'll show you when we get there. I don't want to... Especially on a turn like that, I don't want to injure anyone. Wow. 
The beast from the east. That's what I should name it, the beast from the east. That'd be great. Great name, actually. Go ahead and... Oh, snap, I just passed the charger. The yellow charger, too, nevertheless. Smoked you, brother. Smoked you. shifted to 18th gear, but it's not going any faster than 65. No matter how much I try. I'm just coasting right now. 66. 65 again. Yep. A complete and utter moron. I literally, literally. Made my signal to go into the right lane and then you still crashed into me. Hundred and twenty thousand eight hundred and twenty three pounds. That's crazy. Venting Jewel, what's going on, man? We are going to Arizona, Kingman, Arizona. God damn it. I don't know what this glitch is, but I'm sorry, I'm not going to deal with this right now. Every time I get out of the way station and have a truck in front of me, they never ever merge onto the oncoming traffic. never ever merge onto oncoming traffic ever you just stand there and then like forever and then it slows you down i'm not dealing with that sorry i gotta go struck I think it coasts at 65 miles per hour and safe 
to save uh, fuel, which is fine. I mean, we're we're doing pretty good. We're not even at we're at one third of tank has been consumed. So we have three quarters left, which is more than enough. We're doing just fine. Anybody went and saw Captain Marvel yet? Let me know if you have. I haven't seen it yet. Yeah, I'm not sure why it's doing that. I can definitely go faster, maybe like 70 miles per hour. I'm just not sure why it's... It's not going anything higher than 65. It's definitely saving fuel, I know that. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. That's as far as it'll go. We are at not 195 miles to go. We're doing good with time. We're doing actually very good with time. I shaved off, like, two hours, which is weird, because I've been flying. So... I'm excited can't wait My driver is starting to fall asleep, which is not good. Hundred and fifty five miles to go and we are almost there, people. We are almost there. I 
I said the scenery just looks fantastic. Man, oh man. Hopefully by the time we get there, we would have only used half a tank, which would be great actually. For a 615 mile trip, we've used half a tank, so that's pretty darn good. Yes, sir, I do. Um, there is Truckers MP, which is like 5M, but for uh, American Truck Simulator and Euro Truck Simulator. So you install that on your computer and you join the server and you play with other people as well. The only difference is, is that there are no traffic. So the server doesn't have any other AI cars besides the ones that are played with other players so there are no cars no cops no taxis nothing it's just you and your truck and other players and their trucks and that's it but yeah there are i do play it on uh, truckers mp yes sir Five miles to go and I cannot wait to get that cash can't wait Doing pretty good on time too, so that's pretty good. there now
out. My driver is going to knock out any minute now. Hang in there, buddy. 24 miles to go, man. 24 miles to go. I know you're tired. I know. You don't have to yawn in my ear. here relax Let's go ahead and put it here. Dunskis, look at that. Wow. Almost, almost there. Almost at level 15. I'm like so tempted. So, so tempted. But my goodness, we are $74,791. Let's look at our bank here and uh, we can actually pay off any of those loans. Just one. So we can actually pay, I mean, we can even pay off, you know, anything really. So we can just go ahead and, you know, pay off that $64,000 loan that we have. Um, and that will take off $1,814 off of that $9,000 total. So it'll be like $7,900, which is not that bad at all. I mean, it's still a pretty good amount that we're taking off. We're just shaving that off our... Our stuff but you know anyway that's still not that bad we have one garage and we have three drivers so we have this guy 
2.5 and he does nine dollars and thirty cents per mile and he does six dollars and ten cents per mile they're both the same rating but um and they both have driven almost the same amount of miles so you know it's okay it's okay not too shabby we are doing great current you know current productivity is a hundred and fifty thousand dollars for this garage which is in albuquerque uh in new mexico um so we are doing is it new mexico or is it arizona albuquerque new mexico i think it's new mexico i'm not sure look at the map here let's look at the map here i just want to make sure i'm doing i think it's new mexico i know i know it's new mexico albuquerque new mexico yep so again we did a lot of exploration in california so we did a lot of it actually so hornbrook eureka redding uh this one is done done i think san rafael we did explore it yep um what else we haven't done santa maria yet we haven't done carlsbad we haven't done san diego centro and i believe yuma is on the border with Arizona, but I'm not sure if it's an Arizona thing or if it's a California city. So we have one, two, three, four, maybe five cities left in California. And then we'll be done with the state of California completely. Um, Nevada, we only did Las Vegas. That's it. So we haven't done anything else other than that. We haven't touched anything here at all. So we have to get that done. Um, Arizona's almost done. We only have one, two, three, four, five, maybe six left. New Mexico is almost done as well. One, two, three, four, five, six. So they all have about the same number between five or six, except for Nevada, which we haven't touched at all, except for Las Vegas. So other than that we're doing a pretty good job i mean we explored 31 percent of the map so one third of the map has been explored already pretty much the entire state of uh nevada hasn't been explored just yet so when we come back next time we will continue on with that and we will keep moving on and pushing <sighs> forward i know you're sleeping oh my gosh my ear is gonna like fall apart gonna go ahead and get him to sleep because my goodness I'm gonna fire you right now if you don't stop yawning in my ear like that. Let's see if we can actually do something to our truck. Well, we need to do some service. So, it's not bad, $72,000. Um, is there anything else that we can add? Available from level 20. I don't know what this is, but this looks pretty darn cool. So, level 20, level 15, 17, and 18. So, we have three more to go. Three more to go, and then we're all done. Uh, let's see here. Okay, and... Oh, snap! We got more engines. Holy moly. Holy moly. What's the difference? I mean, why is that one Caterpillar and Cummings? 
what's what's the difference I mean it's the same thing right it's literally the same exact thing it's just which one do you want that's better I guess they're both the same in everything 1850 pound, uh, pound feet per torque 2508 newton meters 1200 rpm same exact thing I mean I, I'm not sure what the difference is but we can hold off on that level 16 we get a new transmission so level 16 two unlocked at level 18 and one at level 20 uh interior wise don't really care about that colors and everything oh we got something new oh yes i'm getting that bad boy okay what else do we have here probably like new tires we got new tires but what, what is it gonna do anything it's more you can't even see it i, I don't like that um Hmm. How about here? Oh, we can change the flaps. Oh, yes. Oh, you sexy beast. Look at that. Probably tires as well. Don't really care about the tires. How about the interior? Can we do anything in the interior? We already have that. Don't really care about that. Don't care about that. Steering wheel, maybe. Nope. We have them all. Anything back here? Oh, look at my bed. That's nice. It's fantastic. Okay. So, why don't we go ahead and get that engine? Might as well, right? I mean, you know, we have to. It's a must. So, let's go ahead and get that engine right here. We got that. We got that. That's cool. That's cool. Um,. I'm not gonna really bother with the color for now because we already have that, so that's fine. And let's go ahead and confirm. And we done skis. <gasps> dude, dude, dude. Oh yes, oh yes. Look at that baby right there. Oh, so nice. I'm taking a screenshot of that. All right, guys, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much, really, for stopping by and checking out my stream. Uh, Mari General, I appreciate your subscription, man. You are fantastic, and thank you so much for all the good stuff you said. And I hope you really enjoy my videos. Thank you so, so much. Um, guys, if you really enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, give it a thumbs down. That's completely fine with me. No problems at all. Thank you so much for stopping by. Hopefully, I'll be back again tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, have an awesome weekend. Enjoy it. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.